welcome again so now we will try to understand what exactly wordpress is or in short what exactly a content management system is because wordpress is a content management system so let's try to understand that so if you see any website like this one what do you see there are certain menu items on the top there's a text website header there is certain text here there's certain text here then we have a background image then we have cards like structure which has an icon text and then subtitle text similarly this repeats couple of buttons and they have their text and maybe the link where if you click where it should go similarly portfolio section with the card structure with image text so this website has this and it also has blog section if you click it should it will take you to the blog and if you click on this it will take you a page blog page where you will see the details of the blog like you can read the text you can have the author details so now let's say i want to change i want to keep the layout everything as is i don't want to change the layout but i want to change this text without changing my code i want to change this text without changing my code i want to change this background image without changing my code i want to change this icon or this text or this text or maybe uh, a link where this button should go i want to change it without changing my code without needing to do a complete build and deployment of a new code if i want to do that then i need a content management system which will manage the content of my website content means this text this image this text this text this icon image this text this text it can to now it's if some something it can be hello world and it will be hello world without user noticing i should be able to modify it from somewhere and it should reflect automatically without i need to without i needing to do any deployment or code changes that's the power of content management system so the website layout will look exactly same but the text content or the image part or any kind of button links or this menu items can dynamically change without the need of extra developer intervention without the need of extra coding or any extra deployment so it will change on the fly so that power is provided by a content management system there are many content management system like joomla drupal wordpress wordpress is one of the most popular one so we are going to dive into the details of wordpress today thank you let's continue in the next video